Everybody, I'm Mike, and this is the Budding Advice of Rebirth. Alright, so we've done Maggie, we've done Kane, let's do Judas. What's in here? Monstrous Tooth. I'm gonna pick it up so we don't have to pick it up again. I don't want it showing up again. I like the Book of Belial. Book of Belial is actually one of my favorite favorite items in the entire game. Now that we know that that's there, let's try to avoid taking damage to that. That didn't really work out the way that I wanted it to, but hello. There we go. Yeah, one of my favorite uh, items in the game. Um, and so I'm gonna keep it. Especially above Monstro's Tooth. There we go. I'm gonna wait. Go through here. Ooh. Deal with you, and you, and you, and hopefully you. There's a key in there that I can't get to, so screw you. Famine! I'm gonna fight Famine here, gonna pop the Book of Belial. Hopefully take out Famine fairly quickly. Should be in just the head stage fairly quickly, and this might be the fastest Famine fight that I've ever had. I'm gonna grab the Ball of Bandages, and peace out. Okay, basement two. Uh, do this guy and his BS. There we go. I'm gonna pop some of these poops. Good, got a key. Very nice. Anything here? No. Okay. Go back down this way, head into the big room. I'm gonna pop the Book of Belial, do some extra damage. Not that this is a super, super, like, scary room, but it is a room that is really handy to be able to do some extra damage in, and we're not gonna be hitting the boss room right right away, so I am okay with using the Book of Belial right here, right now. Like a Jesus Jones song. Almost ready to go to our shop. Um, this is Best Bud. I'm gonna shoot this poop, see if we get anything here. No? Um, I'm gonna go check out the bottom here. You are gonna have money for me, I'm pretty sure. Even if the rest of these degenerates don't. Hi. Hello. Ooh, the dodges, I've got them. Okay, yeah, you had some money. Figured you'd only have one cent, but oh, we can go to the shop. And the shop's right here. We don't have a key. Okay, let's keep on going then. Don't want to let any of these jerk offs hit the fire. Because they become a lot more dangerous. Key. We're gonna go to the shop. Down here, what do we got? What do we got? Steam sale. Make everything half price, yo. Um. Could grab another spirit heart, could grab another key. Gonna grab another spirit heart because we are Judas. And if we don't grab another spirit heart, I might die. <laughs> there we go. Oh, uh, whoa, hey, hi. Hello. Yeah, that's not cool. Um, so Best Bud is gonna try to help me out, I guess. If he gets near something that is close enough to him. I'm hoping... First of all, to kill that jerk face and to get it right there and pop both of these open. I got one. 
Close enough. Monstro! Deal with the Book of Belial. Scumbag. That jumper's gonna explode. Turn into a bomb. That's okay. Monstro's gonna try to squirt blood at me. You big old jerk. It's okay, I'm gonna try to cry blood on him like a big old jerk too. There we go! Yeah! My favorite all stats up. Magic Mushroom. What do we got in here? We have Guppy's Head, which I will take. Use. And put back down. I love Guppy's Head, one of my other favorite spacebar items, but I actually like the Book of Blau more because it has... You could argue about which which item has the greater damage potential. Uh, I'm gonna take the Mark. This gives me back HP and it also gives me a damage up. What do we have here? Full health, which is booty. And Balls of Steel, which is awesome. We are doing tons of damage now, because I have the Mark and Magic Mushroom. Magic Mushroom is a damage multiplier. Um, Judas here has uh, the highest base damage of any character to start with, and yeah, the Mark gave us that damage up, so... We're going to be doing some pretty good damage here for a little while. What's this? Two of clubs. Good. Double our bombs. Mm, might as well. Let me come back. I want that broken stopwatch. I want it real bad, actually. Hi. Hello. Really shouldn't have taken damage off this room, but I did. So here we are. Of course, because I want that penny, I put it right in the middle of the room where I can't get it. Damn scumbag game. Were there always two flies in in this room? Or did the room just randomly generate another one that I couldn't see from the beginning. That was close. Okay, well, um, looks like I'm gonna be going back here to the shop. All the way back up because I missed my item room, which is clearly off to the right there on top. Um... And I'm going to be getting some money out of the donation machine, which is kind of crappy. Oh well. I guess I'm going to have to deal with it. Um, I'm going to drop a bomb there. Oh, hello. Take that. Broken watch. Uh, I will reiterate the broken stopwatch um, has a chance to slow down or speed up time with a um, weight towards slowing it down. Oh, blow. Pestilence is a big old jerk. That's part of the reason why. So I'm going to be a big old jerk, too. There we go. There we go. Second level bandage girl, which is nice. What do we have in here? Oh, yeah, that. I don't want that. I didn't want it before. I don't want it now. All right, Judas. Two bombs to get in there? Okay, I'll check it out. Second bomb to get in there? Uh, what do we have? What do we have? 
thank you. Whipworm. Whipworm is better than the no trinket we have right now. And as far as trinkets go, Whipworm's actually not t terrible. Whipworm is one of my favorite worms. Whipworm is one of my favorite worms. I'm not going to be able to use Isaac's bed, though. Because it's not real... It's rolling on spirit hearts right now. It's not real useful for us right now. Another spirit heart, which is nice. I'm going to blow this open. And get the heck out of here. I'm going to go over to the left. We're going to get another spirit heart out of Larry Jr. here. Oh, and a bomb and a coin. I... Nope, oh, this is an instance of Broken Stopwatch speeding up the room pretty dramatically, as you can see. Uh, I'm not going to take Petrified Poop, because I'd rather have Whipworm. And I don't think there are going to be that many instances, that many more instances where we're going to be encountering a lot of poop from here on out. A petrified poop gives you a higher uh, probability of getting drops in piles of poop. There we go. And let's just do this like a coward. Go to the right here. Just put a bunch of shots down range and hope we don't get hit. This is Bobby Bomb, which gives us homing bombs, which is kind of nice. Okay, I can't walk for crap. I'll put that there. One bomb for three is a pretty good trade in my books. But. You don't have to take my word for it. Um, no point in going looking for the shop, because I don't have any money. I'm gonna fight the Hollow. The Hollow is charmed because of our second level bandage girl. Hollow is probably also gonna drop some additional money, because there appears to be a champion Hollow. Yep. That appears to be the case. You can grab that penny. Grab that. Grab that. I guess we must have gotten less than three on the last... Yeah, it was on the last run. So we get a red heart. And let's see what's in our double room. Yeah. I'll take Burmstone. If you give me Brimstone for half price, essentially, and I already have really high damage, I'm going to take Brimstone. Every time. Uh, spiders are not something I was looking for. Get that Spirit Heart back. Basically broke even there. I'm going to check out this room. This is obviously an instance where Broken Stopwatch slowed the room down. It looks like our charge for... Uh, oop, explosive diarrhea. Looks like our charge for um, Brimstone is a little bit longer than I had originally thought it was going to be. Um, I'm going to go and blow this up because there's a tinted rock right there, and I'm going to get that key. And I was hoping to also get an opportunity to get a tarot card there, but I didn't. And also get that key, so that's okay. I'm going to, I guess, encounter a similar situation here, but just with getting keys. Alright, what do we got in here? Nothing really super noteworthy, so... 
and donate two more cents to this and peace out come down here and see what we have on offer in this room thanks but no thanks This night. <laughs> Mom's hands. Get rid of that. And get rid of that. Uh, we could have. We could actually buy something from. We could buy essentially anything that we wanted from the store now. Uh, let's go looking for the uh, item room now. Since we've found the boss room. Assuming it's going to be off of this room. No. Surprisingly. Well, you know what? I'm thinking that Whipworm might be causing us to charge slow, more slowly. No, well, maybe not. One way or another, though, it's not going to make much of a difference. Oh yeah, you know what? I think it is making us charge more slowly. I'm gonna go grab that key real quick. Mom's wig will drop uh, friendly spiders, as you can see. Uh, we've got an opportunity for here for goodness. Key and a spirit heart. There was. the rock there. That's why I said an opportunity for goodness. Come down here. And fight the boss. It's the bloat. I hate the bloat. That's part of the reason I hate the bloat. I'm real happy we wrecked the bloat. What do we have in here? Um... I'm gonna take Headless Baby. I'm gonna leave. It's nice to have Creep. Check our time here. Mm -hmm. Got hit. Not overly happy about that. Not so super happy about the Curse of Darkness thing either, but... Uh, what do we have in here? Yeah, I'll, I'll fight you, bro. Monster 2 is like, yeah, I can do that too, man. It's like, and I've been doing it for longer. There would be chub, but there was no chub. What are you? You're just a room with a bunch of stuff in it, aren't you? Tears up, which is nice. Hematomesis, which doesn't matter. Double card. Um... Infamy. Key, money, and a heart. The rest of this crap I don't really need. And that room was sped up, so we probably won't see another sped up room for a while. Um, I'm gonna avoid that way if I can. I'm gonna go check out this curse room. 
I got flies now. That's a thing. You know what? I also have 11 bombs, so let's... That was dumb. What's this? The Hermit card, okay. I'm starting to sense a pattern. I guess that's gonna be the Hermit too. Ooh, the tower. Well, close enough. Um, okay, I have to go this way. Okay. That worked out. Big fan. Big fan of that. Gonna go across. Um, let me just check out the shop here. I'm gonna grab this. I'm gonna grab this because I'm low on them. I'm gonna grab that. I'm gonna keep on going. I'm gonna blow you up, actually. Uh, yeah, you know what? I could have picked that up. I might go back and pick that up. I've clearly decided not to go back to pick that up. Nope. Live bomb. Mom fight. Take the negative, and we're gonna check out to see what's in here. It's the pact. Puts us at about as much HP as we had before. We are gonna go check out... Ooh, not anything super good. Um, we're gonna grab Gimpy. <laughs> we're gonna piece the hell out of here! <laughs> There's no way I was fighting that. <laughs> Okay, so we just got Gimpy for free. Some of you probably thought I was going to fight that. <laughs> um, and you know what? I probably should have. Um, in order to have some completion on, on, you know, the character. I still can. I have a minute to get in there. Uh, I'm not going <laughs> to. Maybe later. Not later this run, obviously, but maybe at some... Well, no, definitely at a later junction, but... Um... Let me go down this way. Carry you. And you. And you. And you. What's in here? Yeah, if I were, like, guppy or something, and I was super, super strong... I could fly and stuff like that. Yeah, then maybe I would. But I didn't have the most HP. I didn't have any way of generating more HP. Uh, it wasn't super high on my priority list to actually fight boss fight. Scum boss fight? Yeah, sure. Uh, goat head now? Kind of useless. I think so. And Chubb's gonna get it. Like now. Hurry up. Uh, keep on going. Not 
super heavy, but you know, you deal with that. There we go. Down this way. There we go. Death? And we're fighting slow to death. So, slow to death. Just got run over. Third level bandage girl, which is nice. Um, I'm gonna take Lord of the Pit just cause the ability to fly at this juncture in the game is kinda nice. Uh, will it prove to be my undoing? Maybe. Uh, yeah, I'll take Mr. Sack. And Chub. I'm in. Get wrecked. I know what you're thinking. If I can go through like a boss room like that and just wreck those three bosses, you know, just like that, then wouldn't boss room have been uh, the boss room have been easy? Uh, for some bosses, yeah, sure. Absolutely. For a lot of bosses, I would agree with you. Uh, for all of them? Yeah, probably not. The hero font there. Uh, this is probably not the right way to go. And now I'm fighting glass assists. This might be the right way to go. Give her the bomb. Well, that's not the right way to go. Uh, well, thanks for the key back. Yeah, this is definitely not the right way to go. stand a chance. What is this? Ball of Steel. Thank you. Uh, this is also a Tinted Rock. Take that and get the heck out of the way. Um, could have just gone around that, but I don't know. I wanted to assert my dominance. I've got nothing for you there. If I had the setup I do now, actually, I probably would have fought the, bo uh, the, bo the the boss room, the boss fight room. Deep, 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 deep. And now we're gonna go fight Mom's heart. I'm just gonna go down to Shoal this way, uh, not because I think that there's gonna be deal a deal with the devil, but on the off chance that there's something in those fires. And I'm gonna go to Shoal because I don't think I've fought uh, Satan and the uh, Lamb with Judas. So I'm gonna. Ah! Get those out from. Uh, I get. I guess get those notches uh, on my belt. Uh, keep on going left. Slow down. Not that it really needed to be, but it was. So I guess I'm thankful. Uh, 
Nope, don't need Isaac's fork. Not that I really need the missing second page either, but... I really don't need Isaac's fork. I could get them all at the same time, and I mean, it didn't turn out exactly the way I wanted it to, but it more or less did. Hey, man. Okay. I have to shoot you. I thought it was one of those invulnerable ones. Alright, um, I guess we go fight Satan. some creep. We do some extra damage to the who well we do some damage to the who's just by virtue of them stepping where we were. And just like that we beat Satan. Now we go to the dark chest. Deuce's tongue has appeared in the basement. Tears up. Very nice. Puberty, which means nothing. Guppy's tail. A little too little too late, but... Tears up, and another tears up. Alright. Let's go try to track down the lamp. I really thought you are the one that would have died first. Okay. Uh, if you could just... I'm really happy that these guys are slowed. There we go. Um, that's dope. <laughs> not shooting him because I uh, don't want to, it's because it takes a hell of a long time to charge up. Everybody nice and dead? Okay, good. Yeah, it was Gimpy paying it. Two cents for whatever reason. You know what? Let's check right here. See if we've got maybe a secret room. No. Okay. Well, screw my ideas. Charge! Damn you! And let's go check down here. Does the heart right away and the actual mask? That's kind of nice. And there we go. Strength. Nice card to have. Lucky toe. Sure, I'll take the luck up. This. 48 hour energy? That's okay, I suppose. Oh, get pooped on. <laughs> What's this? No, 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 no. I don't think it. I don't know what it does. Um, if we beat the lamb, I might come back and check that out. I 
I would love a spirit heart or like eight right now. What is this? Strength. Why did I drop that? Uh, oh yeah, that was 48 hour energy. Alright, well. Break this entire room. Spirit heart, thanks. Um, Mr. Boom. Not exactly what I was looking for, but thanks. going down, I guess. Looks like we're going to have to fight the entire damn dark chest. Strength or strength. I think I'll go with the strength card. Stars card. What's this? Aries. Don't know that's particularly helpful for me. Body is already dead. Oh, I didn't even pop the damn book of the wild. That brought me closer to where I wanted to be, but Not exactly where I wanted to be. I wanted to find... Where are you? I wanted to find, uh, Phoenix in a jar. Phoenix in a jar. Dr. Phoenix. That's... Interesting? I'm happy I didn't take it. Like, really happy I didn't take it. Ooh. Actually, let's check out a few things. Ooh. No. Are you a secret room? No. Alright. Well, that's going to do it for this one. If you like this episode or you just want to support the series, feel free to go ahead and click on that good old like button. If you uh, haven't uh, subscribed and you feel like that's something that you may want to do, that button is down there as well. If you have any positive or negative feedback, feel free to leave it in the comment section down below. If you'd like to join me on Twitter, Twitch, or Steam, you can do that by clicking on one of the links in the description and bring it right to where you need to go. But I've been Mike, and you've been you, and this has been The Binding of Isaac Rebirth. Thank you very much for watching, and we'll catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.